Well, Meek Mill says he didn't ever want to learn about politics, but now that he does, he's terrified. This is Jordan Tao with JT News. Let's get right into it. So, Meek Mill, okay? He says, I wish I never learned about politics because now y'all scaring me. Now he's talking about, um, he's talking about the recent events that happened with uh, Big T and Big B. Uh, so you got, uh, got Biden, got uh, the vid, and then you know Trump. They tried to take him out. So he's like, "Oh, you guys are scaring me." How would you have not have known about this, Meek Mill? He's like, I thought I had a career in politics. You don't have a career in politics. You can't even sell any albums anymore. Focus on that first. You got to be loved. They don't love you in Philly, man. They don't love you no more in Philly. So anyways, uh, then we got uh, Joe Budden and Cardi B going back and forth. He claims he never got a lap dance from Cardi B. Cardi B went off on him saying he never says anything good about her. And which... That isn't completely true. He does say some positive things about her, but you know, he he knows what pisses her off, and uh, he he went there. So she goes on a rant. Not a quitter. You quit on your passion. You quit on your passion. I'm not gonna quit, bro. That's the issue. That's the issue with you. You could you critique everybody. You critique every single body. Oh, Joe Budden was in there listening to her in the space. And stop being a hater, bro. Stop being a fucking hater. If hey, somebody man. got 400 million fucking dollars for a deal, and you talk about, yeah, well, they got a yeah. tour, this, this, and that. For, nigga, I'll fucking tour till I'm 65 if somebody give me $400 million. $400 million that you don't have. Stop hating on everybody. Every Everything that somebody do good, you always hate on it. That's bad. That's terrible. She got a point. You always hating on something, bro. You always hating on something. You always hating on something. Mm. It, 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 it sets you apart from being a critic. A critic. A critic hater. from a hater. That's why sometimes I, I I sometimes value academics point of views because he would say mostly the truth than being a straight up hater. You be a hater. How you hating on a nigga got four hundred million dollars? Four hundred million dollars. I tour till I'm ninety, nigga. <laughs> that is funny. She says I'll tour till I'm ninety. Okay. Hey, Joe Budden got called out. Okay. Um, Prince, there was supposed to be a documentary on Netflix, but I guess the estate is not letting it happen anymore because it'll be too long or something. I don't know. I think Prince deserves a documentary on Netflix. Well, one of Kobe Bryant's old friends is trying to call him out for being a hater himself. He says he never helped anybody but his own immediate family, and that's how it should be. I'm sorry, okay? You can't go back and help the whole neighborhood. He gave the guy a fake number. The guy was tight that okay it is what it is um you know there's probably a reason why that happened kobe's not here to explain himself right nor does he have to rick ross another hater stopped uh bobby schmurter from getting money stopped him from doing a show got him removed from the show that's some real hater stuff and soldier boy the amount of money he wants from tash k is 16 million dollars even more than cardi b wanted um, after William, the baddest, after reality star alleged he had a romantic relationship with a rapper. Yeah, Soulja Boy denied these claims, and now he wants to get paid. Can't break news like that. Like, can't do that, you know? It's not good. It's Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, subscribe button, and I appreciate you guys so much for watching. It's not a lot going on, but, you know, keep the news coming. Peace.